Hello students, today I'm going to show you how to insert a text box and how to insert a picture of yourself or a picture um, from online. All right, so here you have insert a text box. To insert a text box, you're going to go up to insert. Now insert means to put in, okay, to put inside. So you're going to go to um, text box and because I have instructions to put it here, just click right by it where you want it and there you see it opens up right away. So it asks for my name. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my name here and that could be it. If you want it to be bigger, you highlight it. Okay, so you get the mouse and you drag it across, it'll be blue. And you go over here, if you wanna make it bigger, see where the number is. Plus means to get bigger, minus means to get smaller and it tells you as you hover. So I'm gonna make it bigger. I wanna make it as big as possible. All right, I like that. Okay, so as big as you need to. If you want to change the font, font basically means the way the letters look, the handwriting. You go right here and it even like when you put your little computer uh, mouse over, it, it'll say font. That means the hand, handwriting. You click that little triangle and you can see all the different types that you can use. Let's say I like, oh, happy monkey. OK, so there it is. That's how you can change the font. If you want to change the color, right here you see an A with a line under it, and as I hover, it says text color. So what you're going to do is you click on that, and here are all the color choices you have. I'm going to choose purple. If you want it to be thicker, that's called bold. You want to bold it, make it thicker, click it. See how it makes it bolder? Or unclick. You choose. I like it bold. Italicize means to make it kind of slanted. That's what that looks like. And if you want to underline your name, that's what it looks like, okay? I'm gonna leave it like that. Now in future, if you ever want to move your text boxes, all you have to do is you do the left click and on your right hand, you move it around. See, I can put it in the middle. I'm gonna left click and then I'm gonna drag it. I'm just gonna keep it right there since it's but since I want it in the middle, I'm gonna put it right here. Now, if you want it to be in the middle, like notice if I click away, it doesn't look like in the middle. Like, miss, I want it in the middle, okay. So what you're gonna do is, I highlight, or actually, if you're just in the text box, you go over here where they have these lines. See how it says align? That means where do you want it? Click the arrow and you put how you want. This means to the left where we're at. This means in the center. This means to the right. This is if you have a lot of words, they'll go in, um, in the middle, but we don't have a lot of words. So if I want it in the middle, I'm going to choose this one. I'm going to center it. Okay, so there's my name. Now let's look at how to insert a picture. There are two ways you can insert a picture. One way is you can insert it, insert it from your computer. Like in other words, you already have a picture of yourself inside your computer or your device. Or you can take a picture of yourself if you have a camera on your device. I'm gonna show you both ways. So way number one, which is to insert a picture that you already have in your device, you're gonna go to insert again. It's gonna be an image. Upload from computer. That's if you have it already in your device. Now you can see I already have one right here. So I'm going to click that. You can click and then open or you can double click and it'll do it. And there's my picture. If you want it to go in the middle, you left click and you move with your right finger where you want it to be. So I want it right in the middle. And there it is. Now, let's say you want to take a picture of yourself. You don't have any pictures in your device, so you need to take a picture of yourself. So I'm going to delete this just so you can see how to do that. You go to insert. You go to image. And then you're going to go into camera. See where it says camera? What's going to happen when I click it, it's going to give a picture of myself. So here we go. And there I am. Give a nice smile. And then your device might look different than what mine looks like. It might have the camera might just say, take a picture. I don't know, but I, I know that this means I'm going to take a picture. And there it is. So I'm going to say insert. And I can move it, left click. Keep the left click down while you use your right finger to move it. And there it is. So those are the two options that you can use to insert your picture on Google Slides. Now I'm going to show you one more thing. Let's say I want you to just insert any picture, okay? If your camera's not working, you're like, well, you know, I'll just try something. So you go insert, go to image. Now see where it says search the web? I'm going to insert search the web. I'm going to click on that. And let's say I just want to find a picture of a teacher because that's who I am. I'm a teacher. 
And I'm just looking through and I mean, there's all types of pictures in here. Okay, there's one, I like the cartoon. Okay, so you click it and you can say insert or you can double click. I'm gonna go ahead and insert. And there it is. So I'm just gonna move it. Remember that's left finger down, right finger move. If you think it's too big, you look for the little corner piece. See that? See how the arrow goes? See, this is to move. It looks like a cross. And this is to resize it, meaning to make it smaller, bigger. I click down, um, I leave my left finger down and I use my right to resize it. See, I can go down to make it smaller. I can make it bigger. So that's what you do and then you can just move it. All right, so these little, that little arrow like that, it makes it larger or smaller. When it looks like this from side to side, it makes it fatter or thinner. So another thicker or thinner. If you do up and down, it makes it taller or smaller. And this one changes right here where you see how my arrow did like, like the cross, that changes the direction. So I can start changing it to be kind of crooked if I want it. And if I want it straight, I go here and I'll say zero, zero, okay? So that is how you insert text boxes. That is how you insert pictures.